Hi, I'm Mark David Heiser from Day Did You Win? And today I'm going to be doing my product review of the Knuckle Lights. The Knuckle Lights are a very simple, lightweight uh, light that you're able to carry with you on your run. Basically, you just take your Knuckle Lights, put them around your hands like this, turn them on, and you're ready to run. Now, I say they're lightweight. These, these Knuckle Lights weigh less than three ounces each. Um, unlike the previous model of knuckle lights, they do not have batteries that you need to replace. They have a docking station that you are able to just slip into the docking station, charge overnight, they're ready to go the next morning. Um, now let's go outside and I'll demonstrate to you the three settings that the knuckle lights have. The knuckle lights have three settings to them. They have bright, dim, and flashing. All three settings are basically to meet whatever your needs you may have. If it's a foggier day, you may not want the uh, extremely bright light lights. Think, think about it like you're uh, driving a car. Um, bright lights don't necessarily work uh, too well in the fog. Uh, you might want the dimmer lights. Um, dim lights should still be able to help you see where you are going and also help uh, oncoming traffic see you as well. Flashing lights um, could be more to get a uh, driver's attention um, if they're not moving over or um, you just want to be on the safe side make sure that you're being seen flashing lights are a great way to do that um, I could think I would think that the flashing lights would be a lot more beneficial um, perhaps when the, uh, around sunrise or sunset when it's not too dark but you're still looking to get a driver's attention over the last couple of weeks of using the uh, knuckle lights uh, on my early morning runs, I've noticed one thing, and that is cars are moving over a lot sooner than what they were previously before I ran started running the knuckle lights. Um, I've noticed in probably about 20, 30 feet down the road, they're starting to move over uh, to their left, to the runner's right, more into the other lane to avoid uh, and giving me more room to run. So that is obviously a huge positive and obviously it's a main reason for it. But also what I'm also noticing for myself personally is that I'm seeing a lot more. I'm seeing um, road conditions ahead, uh, such obviously right now we're in January, seeing the ice on the roads um, or um, as it has been lately, large puddles of water on the road. Um, it has been a huge help for me in that area as well. Um, other than that, I don't really have any complaints other than, uh, for that as far as what I've experienced. My only uh, concern is if one of these rubber uh, rubber pieces breaks, um, there is not, as far as I can tell, a good way of replacing this, taking this off, replacing it with another one. I don't even think that they are available, replacement parts are available. And so, unfortunately, if one breaks, which, like I said, I haven't had any problems with it. It has, uh, it's, they seem pretty strong. Um, but if they were to break, you're, gonna, you're pretty much out the pair of knuckle lights. You're going to have to buy a new pair. Um, so that's maybe the one drawback uh, to them. But other than that, like I said, they are lightweight, three ounces. Um, at times, you just forget, uh, besides the light that is shining bright in front of you, that you're even holding them. Um, I don't notice any kind of interference uh, whatsoever when I'm running. Um, it does not affect me at all when I'm running. So other than, like I said, you can see a lot better. So, you know, if you are a night runner, an early morning runner, I strongly suggest you get a pair of these. Keep yourself safe. Um, you know, you never know what drivers are thinking or what they're looking at. But if you can offer something that's brighter and easier for them to see, a lot less accidents with runners are going to happen. So check them out. Uh, check out the rest of my blog. The link is down below. And uh, thank you very much. Have a great day.